Howdy! How are you? Well, what's this all about? I just have to give my uh, opinion. What happened? Oh, by the way, it's September 11th, 20 something years ago. Now we got that out of the way. Let's talk about the debate last night on ABC around 9 o'clock. Yeah, let, let's talk about that. Like I said a million times before, people think the only office you ever have to vote for is president. And it's like, it's like the Super Bowl. You get to sit down and the last few months, you know, uh, check out the rallies on TV and uh, listen to the ads and uh, have spirit, spirit, uh, spirited uh, debates with your friends about the two candidates. Well, that's what it used to be. But... Uh, the mainstream media, the corporate media, is no longer sources for news. Now you got a cable TV and you got news 24 7. Then you got, you know, if you're a little left of center, you got MSNBC. If you're right of center, then you got Fox News, GOP TV, and uh, but it's become bizarre now. What happens is you have to well, you get candidates that the Republicratic Party, the one party system. That's the Democrats and the Republicans mixed together because they're one party. For the women, you got the Democratic Party. For the men, you got the Republican Party. So they should call it either the Vagina Party or the Penis Party. Because that's, uh, that's what the psychologists call arrested development. Now, we have on the right... The spoiled rich kid who took daddy's money and never spent it correctly. Daddy had to bail him out a few times. He went bankrupt six times. He used to uh, disguise his voice and call up uh, the financial news and magazines saying that he's the richest man in the universe. And he's not. He's not. Then you got a career woman to the left who started out as a, as a lawyer for the state who used to, uh, well, let's say she used to get the bad guys. Attorney general. Then she became, uh, I think she became a senator then vice president, and now potentially the first woman president. And uh, originally, Trump was running against a senile old man, a pushover. Finally, President Biden had to be uh, shoved out of the, of the party. After they fired him, they told him, Isn't he great how he sacrificed himself? Oh, he's so wonderful. Yeah. 
Last night there was a debate between Trump and uh, Kamala, Kamala Harris. And it was a big anticipation. This was like five months before the thing. And, oh, they're going to debate. It's going to be wonderful. Oh, it's going to be, uh, get your popcorn. Yeah. And that's what we got now. We got the Super Bowl. A blah, 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 blah. Oh, she got him on that. Oh, he got her. What a low blow. Americans want entertainment. That's all they care about is entertain me. Entertain me. I'm a little baby. I want to be entertained. Politics is so boring. I'm going to I'm going to buy a Taylor Swift's latest album. <laughs> but what we witnessed last night was how America has a mental illness problem. Watching Trump was like watching a 12-year-old having a fit, a conniption, laying on the stork, laying on the floor of the stork, kicking his leg. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you know what? Biden doesn't like you. Biden hates you. Yeah, that's that's who God sent. That's who God sent, a little whiny Spoiled rich kid going, yeah, yeah, yeah. Haitians are eating cats. No, isn't that terrible? And the whole thing is what the Republicans have been doing for centuries now. Fear. Let's make the white people afraid. Oh, they're coming in billions. They're coming over the fences and they're invading this country and they're going to have sex with your fat wife and... You know, fear, fear, fear. There's crime. Oh, there's crime. And it's all run by Democrat mayors and city councils. Oh, fear, fear. And God is coming back any minute now. The evangelists, when you, when you put libertarian ideas and you put religious ideas, mostly Christianity, and you push fascist and nationalist uh, ideology and put them in, in one big jar, what do you get? Diarrhea. Political diarrhea. And that's what's happening. Uh, Trump is no way a fascist. What he is is just a psychotic little opportunist. He's uh, like B.T. Barnum. He's no Hitler. At least Hitler had a concept of strategy. This guy is, uh, Biden hates you. Oh, he's so strong. Strength. Oh, America is going to the toilet. Oh, we got to make it uh, like Nazi Germany. And become an empire and be strong. Oh, shut the fuck up, you. Boy, I can't wait to get rid of this clown. And how about that stage assassination, huh? Did you know he was flirting around? This guy was so desperate being famous. He even flirted with the World Wrestling Federation, the WFF, back in the 80s. He was some character. I don't know what character was. I guess he played himself. And he'd get into fights, and somebody would squirt fake blood on him. And he would squirt fake blood on the opponent. And it looks like they had a real fist fight. Done in an old old type of uh, action picture. Uh, <sighs> fakery, I guess you could call it. So he come up and the the guy's laying unconscious allegedly on the mat and he's going up like this. Hey, I'm macho man. So what does he do? He takes that knowledge and he gets a bunch of uh, secret service agents to go along with it. And uh, 
Somebody shoots him. Of course, he's a lousy shot because he killed two other people. And he just barely pierced his ears. And Trump thought, well, I'm going to stage this assassination attempt, and everybody's going to feel sorry for me. <laughs> I'm going to win. Well, two weeks later, nobody gave a shit. But last night's debate was pathetic. It was like it was like an Olympic runner running against a guy in a wheelchair. She was so her IQ is so much bigger than his bank account. He's like, oh, you're like, and he lied and he lied about this and he lied about that. And so. Whoopee if she wins, first woman president. Gotcha. Out. Roger and out. So, yeah, it was a big waste of everybody's time. So, enjoy the election. And like I always said, this is the end, my only friend, the end.